We're starting to communicate with our yoga students again, starting to build up our programs. And we have some hacks for you today about how you can get your newsletter or even a blog post out really quickly. So we're gonna open up these hacks and show you exactly how we get our newsletters done fast. Are you ready to become a yoga trainer? Welcome to the Yoga Trainer Fast Track. We help experienced yoga teachers become trainers in their very own yoga teacher training school. If you wish it was easier to have your own training, we share tips and tutorials to make your wish come true. If you're an experienced yoga teacher, like and subscribe to get free resources so we keep making more videos. With that being said, let's get started. So these hacks are actually some of my favorites, and I think that you can possibly relate if you're anything like me. Before we get into the actual hacks, like number one is make sure you keep your email list alive. I know social media between Instagram and TikTok is getting so much attention these days, but if you recall from our interview with business and marketing superstar Leonie Dawson, it is really important to keep your newsletter alive and to grow your email list. There's a lot of reasons she talks about in a different video that we have on that, but basically you don't own the social media. You can't control when it's hacked or when you are removed. You own your, your email list and your newsletter. So that's what we're going to talk about really important to grow your email list and the way that we do it well we can take a look we actually have an outline that aruna and i use mm -hmm. now if you're on our email list you may have noticed we try to tell you a little story and by little i mean 300 words or less something that is easy to digest something that is skimmable and something that helps you get to know us who we are what we're passionate about, why we care about you, and what it is that we have to share. So there's definitely a small story involved. Then there's a point to the story. We can't just ramble on about nothing. The point is the lessons that we've learned, and we've learned a lot of things along the way. So we'll definitely give you a tip with inside that story, talk about the lesson we've learned, and then conclude with an invitation. So it'll be interesting when you're reading our emails from now on, if you're seeing our format, the invitation, another word for that is a call to action. But if you're also like me, when you go to write that story, your mind goes blank the second you sit down at the computer. So this is where our hack comes in. Yeah, this hack is really useful. I use it not only for Ambassador Yoga, but for my other website, I, I use this hack for writing a blog post because I'm trying to build my newsletter and I'm also trying to build my Google juice so that my website comes up when people search my topic or my city or my area, whatever you, your website is going for, my niche. So I do that for newsletters. We talk it into Otter. And Claire, you were telling me about your morning walks. Yeah, I actually have downloaded the Otter app onto my phone because I feel every morning when I walk my dog, all of these great ideas flood into my mind, I'm inspired and I've got, you know, I, I pretend like I'm having this conversation with somebody and the words are just rolling magically, you know, in my mind, they're flowing together and they're concise and I have a point. But then when I come home and sit down at my computer, I go kind of like deer in the headlights. It's all gone. I can't, we call it word salad. I just put words on paper, but they don't actually connect. <laughs> They're all tossed up. So what I've started doing is taking my phone with me on my dog walks. I've got the Otter app. And as I'm walking my dog, I'm just talking. And, you know, it's only me that's going to hear the playback. So if I take pauses or breaks, it doesn't matter. But I talk and as I'm walking, people either think I'm talking on the phone or talking to my dog. <laughs> So it's okay. Yeah. Um, but I really, really love this. And it makes the content a little bit more conversational. Mm -hmm. um, and you can always like edit it afterwards, but it gets your point across really concisely because I'm a better talker than a writer. So let's, let's show people how we do it. So we're going to talk out our email about this newsletter hack. So we've got our three points. So we're going to tell the story about why it's important to have a newsletter. We're gonna do the point of your story. I think the big point is when you're doing everything yourself, you need hacks. 
you need shortcuts. And then our invitation will be to try it out for yourself. That's what we're going to talk out right now. So let's open Otter. Oh, and it's free. That's the say. other cool thing about Otter. Yeah, it's free. This is a great hack. There are, of course, paid options depending on how much usage, but you know, you get an email from us every week and we're still on the free account. So are you ready to go, Claire? Sure. Let's talk it out. I'll start with the story and then you can say the point of the story and then I'll say the invitation at the end. So here we okay. go. I'm gonna record. Here's our, here's our newsletter. So I have to, I'm gonna use my microphone. When you're doing everything yourself, you need hacks to help you get things done. And we found a great hack by talking out our newsletter. And what it does, it is allows us to make our newsletter very conversational. It lets us capture our ideas so that we don't forget them. And it helps us avoid writer's block because we can just pretend that we're talking to a friend when we're talking into the Otter app, which is transcribing what we're saying. Absolutely. And when we sit down at the computer to send a message to our guests on our newsletter, sometimes it feels like we have nothing to say and the words can't come together. It's much easier to move forward thinking about having a conversation and we want you to learn from our mistakes of staring at a blank screen and use this hack so that you can proceed with your newsletters quickly and efficiently in a way that works for you because doing everything on your own is difficult. Learn from our mistakes, get the app on your phone, talk it out, and have fun with your newsletters so you can really connect with your audience. Because in the end, having a person's email is your best marketing tool. All the followers on Instagram that you build up or all the followers on YouTube or all the followers on uh, Facebook, you don't actually get to talk to them directly. But if you build up your newsletter, it will be a good choice for your business. And that's what we've found. Building up the newsletter is a great choice for business. And so I invite you to sign up for our newsletter at ambassadoryoga.com. And when you do, you will see how we took this transcript and turned it into a newsletter. And I think you'll find it very interesting because obviously we're going to edit parts of this, but it will give us a really good foundation for our newsletter. Okay, so I'm stopping recording. <laughs> so I think pe people get a feel like when you're thinking about what to say, <laughs> it's like, okay, have a conversation. Sometimes there's big pauses when I'm ordering it out. And sometimes I, I say something and then I realize, oh, that's not what I want to say it. I say it again the way I want to say it. But then in the end, I end up with a transcript that becomes the foundation that then I edit and turn into the newsletter. Exactly. And it's so easy to edit. You just, I just copy the text from Otter into a Word document. And I correct my name from clear to Claire. And I correct what Otter sometimes transcribes your name into. Um, Arena, we get a lot. Arena. Arena. I thought it said talked. It, it said tucked. So you've got to you've got to check it. And then it it processes the note. It takes like sometimes 15 minutes, usually less. And then you get you get a transcript. And then we edit from there. So I think I think people get the point from that. Yeah, it's very easy. It's a great hack. It gets your thoughts out of your head and essentially into a transcript, which can get into paper. And then it's so much easier. It's like your first draft is already written. You do need to tweak it, 
and out it goes to the world. So go ahead and connect with your students. We hope you love this hack. Tell and your stories, tell your story oh. to your students. Tell your stories, build relationships with your students so that then they wanna take teacher training with you. Um, and we'll go from there. Let us know when you're ready.